Welcome back to Weird Stuff in a Can. Today's Weird Stuff in a Can is sugarcane drink. So yeah, this is sugarcane drink, TAS brand. I bought this in the International Food Store in Portswood. It cost 99 pence and it is a can of drink made from crushed sugarcane. So the ingredients are water 54.9%, sugarcane juice 40%, Cane sugar, 5%. So sugar cane juice, and then they've added some sugar. That's good. Good to know. Uh, citric acid regulator, 0.1%. Distributed by TRS Wholesale in the UK. Product of Thailand. Manufactured by well, TAS, I presume. Vara Food and Drink Co. In Thailand. Serve chilled. Store in a cool place, product and expiration date on bottom of can. Well, let's just check, 2023, so we're well in date. Chill and shake well before serving. Good to know that you have to shake it. That presumably means it's not sparkling. So, it's a pull tab can, so, you know, um, I'm just kidding. So, uh, let's open it up and have a look. Nice hiss. That's interesting. A little bit of pressure there. I presume that's just the pressure in the can and the froth where I'd shaken it up. Right, so it's a slightly cloudy, pale straw brown colored drink. Sort of the color of, <laughs> I'm gonna say, it looks like dirty water. Let's, let's be honest. Yeah, sort of pale, greenish, brownish, yellow coloured, cloudy drink. Let's have a sniff. It smells just ever so slightly leafy or vegetal. It doesn't really have much of an aroma. So let's have a taste. Sweet. Sort of slightly grassy, and that shouldn't be a surprise because sugarcane is indeed a grass. Ever so slightly fruity, yeah, fruity sort of flavour, maybe. And slight nuttiness, like maybe coconut water as well. So quite pleasant. Doesn't actually taste as sweet as I might have expected. Hmm, interesting. So in this can, total sugar is 33 grams in a... 310 mil can. But here's a fun fact. The amount of sugar in here, in this can of sugar cane drink, is exactly the same amount of sugar as you'd get in a can of Coke. So it just seems a bit bad when it's labeled sugar, doesn't it? That's interesting. Bit of psychology there, I'm sure. But there you go. So yes, 33 grams of sugar is actually probably a little bit less than, I think Coke has about 35 grams of sugar in a can. It is strange that it's got sugar cane juice and it's got added sugar, but uh, I guess they didn't think it was sweet enough. So let's just have another go at describing the flavour of this. Right, so sweet, tiny little bit earthy and grassy, nutty like coconut or tiger nuts, and ever so slightly fruity but in a very, very nondescript way. So that was interesting. I thought, I don't suppose I'll be drinking much of this. I don't tend to drink very many canned drinks except for this series. And I don't tend to like really sweet things. This doesn't taste really sweet, but obviously the other flavors there are hiding some of the sweetness of that sugar because it is actually quite a high sugar drink. So really probably not much more to say about this. So let's just keep it short and sweet. But I thought that was interesting anyway. So there we go, that's Weird Stuff in a Can, sugarcane drink on Atomic Shrimp. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you again soon.